The Land Transportation Franchising and Regulatory Board is shocked to know that Grab and Uber have more than 100,000 vehicles registered in their systems combined. The house hearing on the two ride-hailing companies' lack of registration and franchising is held Wednesday. Uber says it has more than 66,000 partners who have taken at least one trip in the past year. Out of that number, only 2,500 have either a provisional authority permit or a certificate of public convenience franchise, which allows them to ply the streets. Grab has more than 52,000 vehicles accredited, with only 3,000 to 4,000 having PA permits or CPC franchises. LTFRB Chairman Martin Delgra says until the hearing, the number of vehicles registered under Grab and Uber wasn't clear. Grab and Uber have been in a regulation deadlock with the LTFRB over unregistered drivers. Several lawmakers said it's no surprise traffic in Metro Manila has worsened because of the sheer number of ride-hailing vehicles on the road. But Grab and Uber say not all of the vehicles registered in their networks ply Metro Manila at the same time. They say some vehicles are registered with both companies, and some drivers only drive their vehicles for a few hours a day at most.